Hey guys, it's CodeZealot, and I'm back with another video on the execute command in Minecraft 1.13. Today, we're going to learn how we can teleport between dimensions. So let's go ahead and start teleporting between the overworld, the nether, and the end. Okay guys, so the first thing we need to do is go ahead and press forward slash to open up our chat and type out the execute command. Now once we have this typed out, we're going to use the in option. And then after we've typed in, we're going to go ahead and we're going to pick the dimension that we want to be teleporting in. So right now we're in the overworld. So let's just go ahead and use overworld. And then we're going to go ahead and run a new command, which is going to be TP. We'll teleport ourselves, the nearest player, and we need to give it some coordinates. And so let's just use these relative coordinates, which means exactly where we're standing. And then we're just going to alter this last one by three blocks to move us three blocks from our current position. If I press enter, you can see that we have teleported. Now, we've teleported in the overworld, and since we are inside of the overworld right now, this command is basically the same thing as a simple TB command. However, if we go ahead and change the overworld as our dimension to something like the nether, what we'll see happen next is we will actually leave the overworld and teleport in the nether. Now, since we're using this execute command and we have this in option, it's assuming that we are in the nether already. This is kind of how this command works. It basically execute in and then you supply the dimension says, hey Minecraft, I'm going to execute a command in the nether, which means that whatever coordinates we supply here are going to be coordinates in the nether, not in the overworld. So let's go ahead and type in, let's say just 10, and then for y we'll do a 64, and then 10 for the z. Now when we press enter, it says we're joining a world, and that's because we have just left one dimension, which was the overworld, and have gone into another one, which is the nether. So if we go ahead and press uh, T, open up the chat, press up to bring back the command, and then switch this out for the end instead of the nether, we can see that we can teleport from the nether to the end. And it's using the same exact set of coordinates that we just had typed in there. So this is location 106410 within the end. And the Ender Dragon is here. Oh my goodness. We teleported right into the Ender Dragon's lair. Where is he at? I have my render distance turned down very low because I'm playing on an old computer. And sadly, I can't get the gaming experience that a lot of you guys have when you post all your... Uh, your screenshots on the Discord server of amazing buildings and stuff like that. So I am going to be getting a new computer sometime in the very near future, so I'm excited about that. It'll make the videos a lot better, because we'll be able to see things in the distance, like the Ender Dragon. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for this video on the execute command. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Go ahead and hit the like button if you like this video, and subscribe to the channel. And also hit the bell icon, so that way you can get a notification whenever I upload a new video on this channel. Also, if you're a part of the Discord server, there is a channel inside of that server that notifies you every time a new video is posted on this channel. So go ahead and check that out if you haven't yet seen it. Alright guys, I'll see you all in the next video.